Well, Aaron, last summer the Salinas City Council voted to ban all fireworks in the city, including the safe and sane fireworks. Tonight they had a decision to reverse their decision, but instead decided to send the issue to voters. The Salina City Council forced to reconsider its ban on all fireworks, including safe and sane. After a successful petition drive called for the council to reverse the ban or put the issue before voters. We have to stop the terrorism in our neighborhoods. I respectfully request that the city council does not would not spend the taxpayer money to put this matter on the ballot. Um, and to approve it tonight. By a unanimous vote, the city council refused to lift the ban and instead sent the issue to Salinas voters to determine whether or not safe and sane fireworks should be allowed in city limits. The election expected to cost taxpayers between three hundred and four hundred thousand dollars. The people I heard from said you did the right thing the first time. Please continue to do that. Please, please, please leave the ban as it is. We all know these signatures were obtained fraudulently. Tuesday, accusations arose that signature gatherers misrepresented what the petition was for. Councilwoman Jill Lutz said people were told it was so school kids could sell sparklers and to bring back a community fireworks show. A spokesman for TNT Fireworks, which bankrolled the petition drive, had this response. There is a recourse for that, and it's clearly if in fact that uh, any of those incidences took place, then those individuals should be prosecuted. Both the fire chief and police chief stood behind their original decision to oppose all fireworks, saying it's a safety and enforcement issue. Nonprofits, which earn a quarter million dollars a year from the sale of safe and sane fireworks, said the voters should have a voice. Put it out there, guys. Forget the signature, forget the gatherer's lies, Put it to an election and see what your people say. Most logical, most democratic way to do it. And so again, Salinas voters will have a say as to whether or not safe and sane fireworks return to this city. The election will be the June 7th primary election. And the spokesman for TNT Fireworks says even if voters approve the fireworks, they won't go on sale until next year. Aaron, Dan. All right, Felix, thank you. And now regarding that petition and the accusations that people gathering the signatures misrepresented what it was for, Felix told you a little bit about that. Well, the city clerk reminds anyone who has asked to sign a petition, don't take someone's word for it. Ask to actually read the petition. If you're not allowed to read it, don't sign it.